Hey folks, today is August 28th, 2013, and it is day six of my medical fast. Um, not a good day today in general. As you can tell, just basically from the way I look, I'm not my normal fabulous self. Um, I think I'm feeling the effects of the detox and I'm getting ready to start my period. So those two things combined have me not feeling like a happy camper. Um, they had told me that um, during the detox process I might get headaches and maybe feel a bit nauseous and feel a bit blah. And I do feel like that and like I said I also am probably having like PMS symptoms as well. So my head hurts and I just feel like crap in general. But I did go for my check in today. I lost another two pounds. I was 239.5 last time I was there. I was 237.5 today. I will take that. Um, it's not as much as I wanted to lose, but I didn't exactly present myself as a stellar fasting student. Um, I drank tequila Saturday night and I drank tequila last night. Granted, I didn't have a lot, but the fact that this is supposed to be a detox and I'm supposed to be actually pulling toxins out of my body and not putting toxins in it... Um, means I was just a little bit counterproductive. I probably stuck to it about 80 or 90 percent. No, maybe closer to 80. And then there also was a birthday party. So I had some slivers, like not whole pieces of cake, but some slivers. But, you know, so all in all, um, not wonderful progress, but, you know, not too bad seeing as this is my first extended fast. Um, I'm pretty happy in general with the way things are going. Um, I'm just going to keep moving on. I do start my next second phase of HCG next Friday. So it's going to be interesting doing the binge and everything again. I think that's the only part that I'm scared about. On the one hand, I'm exciting about, excited about being able to eat like shit for a couple days. But on the other hand, I'm scared to gain any weight now because there's still that part of me that's just so afraid of getting back up to where I was before, even though I know the binge process is a part of HCG. So, you know, this is basically what my body looks like right now at 237 pounds um i really see the biggest difference oh sorry i really see the biggest difference here like i said this fat wall right here is almost completely gone um and getting a little bit of a booty um i still haven't lost well my gut is still going away I, you know eventually i want all this gone but this is still progress. I see a lot of my belly button and stuff. So, um, yeah, so this is me right now. Like I said, so I'll be happy when this right here is completely gone, but we are getting there. I can really see here in my thigh area, all this skin is kind of starting to shrink up a little bit. So I'm just going to keep it moving. Um, and obviously I still have, you can't tell because I have on black panties. But there's still um, some fat roll right here too. But, you know, hey, it's me. It's going away. And like I said, when I started this process, I was 273 pounds. So you're not really going to hear any complaints out of me. So I'm just going to keep trucking. Um, I feel like next week's going to be a much better week because I'll be finishing up the fast and I'll be off my period and hopefully be back regular. I'm still having problems with being constipated. Um, I think that's been the only consistent issue, but I also know that the intestinal cleanse that they gave me, you're supposed to take it on a regular basis, but I take it until I take a shit and then I stop taking it. But I think right now I need to be taking it consistently. So I'm going to start doing that and hopefully I'll stay regular more often. And I think I'm going to see a difference in my weight on a regular basis. Uh, usually in the mornings now when I wake up, I'm like 233, 234. Um, by the end of next week, I'd love to be going to bed at 233, 234. Um, and, you know, kind of be stabilized at that weight. Um, I really am excited about trying to get into the late 220s <laughs> because then 219 is right around the bend. Um, the other nutritionist that I've been seeing, you know, really wants me to set my goal weight at 190. But I'm trying to get to 213 first, which was the first goal weight, and then 190 will be the second. But hopefully I can get to 213 by the end of my second round of HCG and then be at 190 you know towards the end of the rest period for my second phase of hcg so i'll check in again in a couple days um hopefully by that time i'll be feeling better maybe you know some of the effects of the detox will lessen a little bit um and maybe i'll just kind of be in a much better frame of mind i'm not my usual optimistic self i'm just tired and just want to go to bed so anyway that's me good bad ugly indifferent whatever it's my life deuces